Blade is submerged. You lie now, but it's our only option. All right. Adam, I was very surprised when I first met you. Why? Back in the colony, we learned that everyone on Earth was completely wiped out. I'm sure it must have seemed that way. But you can't expect Mother's Fear to know everything. Then there are other survivors out there, like you. Mm. Yes, but it's rare to see them. Earth is still pretty inhospitable to humans. We're here. Where's the transportation device? Try activating this monitor now. to reorganize the code in order to restore power. That's great. Try activating the monorail panel again. Something is heading our way. Don't worry. It's the monorail. This ancient electronic device is our transport. All right, then. After you. remembering something from yesterday. This city, it's so quiet, and so lonesome. Well, that's what happens when a city becomes devoid of humanity. Eve, what are you going to do after you defeat the Alphanitiba? 
All airborne squad members exist for one sole purpose. All we must do is complete the mission. You mean the extinction of all Natibas? Right? To think that the point of your existence is to snuff out another species. <laughs> no fun in that. Looks like this used to be a plaza. You're right. Except it's underwater now. The good thing is you won't have to go in the water. The Hall of Records is that way. As I thought. It's locked. The security code will be in one of the Legion's soldiers. We have no choice but to search them all. Let's look for the Legion in the square building. Shopping done. Adam, do you meet airborne squad members from the colony often? No, not really. Yesterday, I just happened to be around the area. I've never seen such a large-scale airborne operation. Why did you save me? Hmm. I'm not really sure. It just felt right. Like I was meant to. It's hard to describe. It's just a short, intense feeling. But you try jumping and dashing.
I need a four digit password. Uh, another headache. Okay. This sign reads time. Could this be connected to the clock tower? I can see the Hall of Records. We're almost there now. power control room. like this before. The system was put through a reset when the power was cut off. I'll have to verify the credentials once power is restored. Why don't we force our way in? Let's not do that. If the safety system goes off, we'll never be able to enter. Let's look around the Victory Monument first. These stairs lead to the power control room. It looks like the fusion cell's dead. Wait, I'm sensing another fusion cell around here.
Great. Power has been restored. We'll head down to the Hall of Records now. All we have to do is find the hyperdrive. At the start of the 22nd century, humanity's right to life was threatened by advanced global warming. Having foreseen this, Mother Sphere ensured mankind could meet this challenge. The eons-long process of natural adaptation resolved near instantly. The body cell replaced the heart and made it possible to survive in environments without oxygen or water. Thanks to advances in biotechnology and nanotechnology, the inconveniences of aging and disease were a thing of the past. This created giant leaps forward in the development of hazardous industrial spaces and space itself. We can now withstand the crushing pressures of the deepest oceans and even exit a space station without the need of a spacesuit. Humanity's greatest and only hope for survival can be found in Mother Sphere. Please, enjoy the harmony and prosperity of Ados 7, the first city ever built by Mother Sphere, the mother of... I have no idea what that was all about. Adam, did it make any sense to you? Mankind's past was buried with the final war. This must be a video from before that time. So, is this what you're looking for? Yes, you can extract it from the hyperdrive. Great, we accomplished our first objective. Let's go before the emergency power runs out. to do a lot of good. Eve, thank you. Um, okay. Then, can you tell me where the Alphenetiba is? <laughs> of course. It isn't far.
totally exhausted before we even get to the Alpha. Should we head down again? No, just follow the path and go straight. We've come quite far. How much more do we have to go? We just have to pass that sewage facility. There must be a way to get across. We can build ourselves a bridge if we use that crane. Try using the crane. It's not working. Hmm. But there is power. That's strange. Oh! We need an ID card if we want to operate it. Three of them, actually. If the ID cards are needed for the crane, then they should be nearby. I'll look for the closest one first. Take your time. Adam, I have a question. What is it? The hypercell. If it sustained the Hall of Records until now, it must be a huge source of energy. Yes. Even compared to a fusion cell. Then, where are you planning to use this energy? Oh, well, it's kind of a long story. But I can explain more when you come back. Understood. Loud and clear. for the rest. <laughs> Let's the lift that goes to the upper floors. We need power to make it move.
generator here. The lift should work now. I wonder what it looked like before the war. <laughs> what do you think it looked like? Well, probably upright buildings, well manicured flora, and living people. That's it? You have no imagination. Then again, I guess you've never been here before. Imagine bustling streets, crystal clean air, and people smiling everywhere you look. Have you ever seen something like that before, Adam? Yes. A long time ago. <laughs> Eve, are you ready to leave? I just wanted to imagine what you were telling me. <laughs> it's hard to imagine. Let's go. to upgrade the drone. Locked up tight. But the hacking tool should get it open before you know it. What is this? It doesn't seem useful, but it looks intriguing. I'll look into it later.
Nice. Now use them on the path. <laughs> Let's go to where you placed the structure. Excellent. We're almost there. We'll find the Alpha as soon as we get through this place. Oh, it's collapsing! Do you think you could come down here? That's a key. We'll use it to deactivate the security. <laughs> uh, there isn't enough water. Hold on. You have to dive down to open a different valve. Found the key. Should be enough. You can get out by going back to where you started. This way. Exits to the right. We're almost there. <sighs> We're 
finally outside. See that crater over there? That area is Alpha Nativa territory. What's a drop pod doing there? It was abandoned a long time ago. Matter of fact, it's what made this crater. Wait, that's a 5th Airborne Squad drop pod. Let's take a closer look. up a distress signal coming from that drop pod. That means... There might still be survivors. Really? I can't say for sure, and the Alpha Nativa could appear at any moment. So let's make sure we're well prepared. something.
My goodness. I can't believe this. This is the Alpha Nateba. You can tell by looking at its core. An Alpha core? If she were... Eve. Hmm? Uh, there's something you need to know. The truth is... Hello? Here! Can somebody rescue me? Please? A human voice? In the pod. If you're there, please help. Ah! What the? Uh. A survivor from the airborne squad. Oh. Were you the one who sent the rescue signal? Huh? Oh, yes. Yes, it was me. You're a member of the 7th Airborne Squad, right? Yes. And you? Right. Let me introduce myself. I'm an engineering support of the 5th Airborne Squad. Lily Artemis II. But you can just call me Lily. <laughs> So just to recap, you were in that hideout waiting for another squad to arrive for almost two years? And then you met us. Yes, thank you so much for saving me. I've been waiting a long time for the next squad to come in. It's been really lonely here. It's really lucky we were able to find you when we did. Eve, you're from the Airborne Squad Assault Force, right? Yes. Then I can be your engineering support. Of course, I will need proper equipment first. Equipment? Hmm. Well, I did want to say something earlier. What is it? Actually, there's a city where other survivors, besides me, live. What? Really? It's called Zion, humanity's last city. If we go there, there might be people that can help us. I have a safe house with some equipment I bet you would want. Then let's head there quickly! Before that, I would like to ask you something. Currently, Zion is holding out under the guidance of Orko, who is also our spiritual leader. It's complicated. Eve, I imagine completing your mission isn't any easier having lost your comrades. So, please. Help me save Zion. If you do, I promise Oracle and I will do everything we can to help you on your mission. It's about joining forces and helping each other, just like we did before. Sound good? Yes. Thanks to teamwork, I was able to get the Alpha Core. Maybe we can get more information in the city, Eve. Think about it. Yes. I suppose there's no reason to say no. However, I want to decide after hearing the story from that person you're calling Orkel. That shouldn't be a problem. Okay, I can definitely get behind that idea. Well, I guess that settles that. Alright then, let's head to Zion. Yes! 